Hey guys, welcome back to the second part of Luigi's Engine Room. We're about to play Buried Treasure. And um, today, we're just going to talk about Idol for a little bit, and then um, hopefully talk about S&W, too. Because uh, it's a little bit behind. It's still very behind, I know. But, um... Yeah, so Idol was on last week. I didn't even I didn't even talk about last week and Wario I think is gonna get it. I I think I missed her. <laughs> Too bad there was no arrows on this one to really help anyone. But anyways, um yeah, Idol was on last week and James got voted out. I wasn't really that surprised. But at the same time I really felt like <laughs> Scotty should have win. I mean, I don't know, Bowser, um, but yeah, I just felt like, felt like Scotty should go, and then this week just exemplified that, Bowser's chance time, alright, um, but yeah, they saved Lauren first, and that was fine, then Haley was saved first, I actually was very surprised, I thought if Lauren was safe, I thought Haley for sure probably was gonna go. But no, that that was not the case. I was really, I was actually surprised because you know, I didn't think after all, so many women have been voted out this season, I didn't think that the women stood a chance, stood a chance to be in the final. And now at least there's going to be at least one of them in the final two, so that's good. Hopefully we can get the hopefully I hopefully those two can be in the finale. But um. I'm going to check my the moves right now. I'm going to switch the thing so I can get to that star. Um, yeah. So it came down to James and Scotty, and I was hoping, please let it be Scotty, and then it was James, so... Not much I can really say. Oh, that's good. One versus three, and it is... Pipe Maze, okay. Um, yeah, so, last week, James went, and it was okay, I guess. At this point, anyone can go, so. Mediocrity is not really that good. So, last night, um, was the final three performed. And, uh, you know, I, I thought it was okay. The night was just... The night to me, I still feel like at this point the top best three should be still standing. And I feel like what a surprise <laughs> that that uh, Peach won. But yeah, I, I really think at this point the top three should be the strongest three left. And to me, I just I don't think that that happened. Everybody's getting stuck in that turnaround. <laughs> but yeah, um, I really expect better from everybody at this point. And, you know, there was still like half the performances were just not that great. You know, I just... You know, I still don't know why people have been saying this. I mean, at the beginning of the season, I don't know why people were saying this is the best season so far. I don't think so. That star space right there is one of the hardest to get. Mainly because of the uh, the walls that are right next to his toad. You have to hit it exactly when the blue wall comes down. And at the same time, Bowser's over there too. So you have to pay 19 every time you go try to go over there. Hopefully you can get it once and we'll get it. And it won't be that difficult. But um, yeah, this is not a hard... I mean, that that's the only star space that's really hard to get on this board. But yeah, last night I just was, really was not taking a lot of these performances. You know, they had their choice. They had their choices. <laughs> Donkey Kong got voted. He got blasted off the island. Come on! Oh my gosh! I don't know why I didn't die right there. But yeah, um, I didn't die right there either. <laughs> Okay. 
Oh, nice. Um, but yeah, the first performance of the night, they, they all got to choose their own choices. The second song was by Jimmy Iovine. He got to choose their songs. And then the last choice was for the judges. And, um, overall, you know, I wasn't that impressed. I don't know, at this point, it, I still think that they should be doing better than what they're doing right now. Great. Not gonna move it. But yeah, the first round, um, I actually was expecting be the best from them because they get to choose the songs that they wanted to sing. And for them to choose kind of mediocre choices, for the most part, was just not that great. Um, and the judges' choices and the Jimmy Iovine's choice, there's not much you can really do. You you get the song that you're chosen, or that they choose, and then you do it. I mean, so, there's not much really to say about it, so... Oh, that's the big one right there. So, um, for Scotty, for the most part, um, it was consistent, but it was consistently painting in the lines. Like, like a three-year-old trying to color in its coloring book, his coloring book, or their coloring book. Um, it just really was like that. It was, there was nothing really special about any of his performances. They were solid, but for him, they were solid, but... So what? And the mini game. And it's shell game. Okay. Um, yeah, he sang Amaze. It was good vocally, but, you know, I expected better for his choice. Are you gonna kiss me or not? It was fine, but again, painting in the lines. And then the She Believes in Me. Really just. It was just okay. That. To me, I think he's not strong enough of a vocalist to sing that, so I really wasn't digging any of Scotty's choices, and that's pretty much why Scotty should go. Being consistent is not good enough. It's it's also trying to have like trying to take a risk and actually, you know, succeeding. He didn't really hasn't really succeeded at anything. You know, that's great. You know, they were okay. They were all okay. Nothing really like bad, but at this point, you know, it should be better than that. Lauren, um, for the night, I think she had two good performances. She had one bad one. Um, her first performance of Wild One by Faith Hill, that was just not, that was not good for me. The reason being is because it, it was very safe and it was very, it was actually kind of forgettable. I'm gonna play it now. Piranha's great. <laughs> okay. Um, it was very safe. It just, to me, it was forgettable. I think it sounded too much like her any of her other songs that she's done, so there was just, it wasn't that, like, special for me. Um, the other two songs, If I Die Young, I thought she did a good job with it. But, um, she did mess up a little bit at the end. You know, she didn't hit... She either stopped saying some of the words or something. I don't remember. I don't know what happened there, but... She did all right. She did well on it. Um, and the last performance, I Hope You Dance, by the... By Leanne Womack for the, the Judges Choice. That was really... I thought that was their best... Her best performance of the night. So... You know, Lauren. Lauren ha does have confidence issues, but at least she has pulled a couple of good performances for me that I at least remember. So I don't know. She, she was all right. she was good last night, but I just felt like that. I think she can do better. I still always think that she has potential, but she just does not like. I still want her to push her more because she's better than what she shows. 
Whereas Haley, you know, I think she really pushed herself the last night. I mean, the first song, What Is, I mean, the first song she sang by Led Zeppelin, What Is and What Should, um, what is it called? What Should Never Be? What Is and What Should Never Be by Led Zeppelin. Um, very risky song choice. If she, if she asked me, if she told me five weeks ago that she was going to sing Led Zeppelin, I pretty much would have said she's crazy. Because she's, it's very hard to sing Led Zeppelin, you know, so. So, um, but now, the lately, she's been getting a lot of steam from a lot of her performances, so. Um, I, I wasn't like. I wasn't mad that she chose Led Zeppelin. I actually thought, yeah, she should choose Led Zeppelin because, oh my gosh, <laughs> okay. I actually think she should ch choose Led Zeppelin because um, it was a risky song choice. It was interesting, um, and I think she could have made it her own. You know, so that, and that's basically what she showed this that that night. She really showed that she she has really improved since the beginning. She really has um, her. Her vocals have gotten better. She stopped growling too much. Um, she she puts it right where it's supposed to be, and then she um, she sings the songs well. So um, Haley really should be in the finale for me. Um, Rhiannon, I liked it. I thought her second song, Rhiannon, I liked it. Um, I don't think it was as great as her first performance, but. Um, I thought she sang it really well. I thought it was very interesting to watch her listen. We're not moving very much. <laughs> and then uh, last performance, the Alanis song, You Oughta Know. I didn't... Again? Piranha's Pursuit? Uh, this is like exactly the same thing as the first time we played just a couple of minutes ago. But yeah, You Oughta Know, it was just alright. That one was her bad performance. Um, her low notes just were not there. So for me... I didn't think it was a good choice for the judges. Um, I really, really hoped that Lauren and Haley are in the final two. I still think it's going to be one of the girls tonight because Scotty has just so. Oh my gosh, I messed up. <laughs> How did I not die? Oh god, well now I'm dead. <laughs> well now. How did I not die in the first one? Oh, I don't know. But yeah, hopefully, hoping for Lauren and Haley, but who knows.